Hey everyone, Josh here, and today I'm going to be doing a bit of a tour of uh, my house. So uh, this is my house, of course, I'm talking about Minecraft here, and uh, it appears my dog has followed me, and he's looking rather creepy. Stay back. Demon. Uh, so, as you can see, it's a rather large house, uh, surrounded by other nice houses. There's a nice house over there. Uh, so let's go in. Actually, should we take a look outside? Let's take a look outside first. So uh, here we have the, what's well, essentially the front garden, surrounded by uh, hedges, and some uh, glowstone there. Not allowed to see the inside just yet. All part of the door. So uh, here's the pool. It's quite a deep pool. Maybe about one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine mm. blocks deep. Uh, the outside of it's made of diamond. So I have bragging rights there. This is a bit of a joke, by the way. This video, um, I'm not, I'm not actually being, uh, you know, serious. Uh, so apparently, there's uh, some. Sh what the hell is going on there? Right. Uh, so <laughs> there's animals in my backyard. I hadn't actually put them here, so I gather they must have just sort of walked in by the record. Uh, this is the shed. There's nothing really inside the shed at the moment. It's just sort of. Sort of there. That's that's pretty much just the guest room. Uh, so uh, so yeah, has has the nice uh, bar here with uh, some chairs over there and tables. Probably put some more chairs and tables here. Maybe this can be a little dancing stage. I don't know. So uh, let's go over to the front. Uh, let's take a stroll around the house. It's not much on the other side. It's pretty much just the same as this side. Uh, so let's go in. There we go, there's the door system. Oh, I didn't show you. Got a nice doorbell there. We'll show the doorbell control room soon. Uh, so this is the main house. Here is the hallway. Uh, rather grand staircase. You can see you've got this nice snow and uh, and wood finish there. So I believe that yes, this is the uh, this is the study of sorts. You see, we've got uh, some bookcases and uh, essentially a couch, but I made it out of uh, minecart so you can actually sit down. That's the office chair and uh, some reading material. So uh, there's a the little table there, chest of drawers or something. Uh, so that's the that's kind of the office type area. Uh, this is the main sitting area for meals. You see we've got a nice white tablecloth here and some placemats. Uh, also kind of the executive boardroom where I have meetings with uh, server members sometimes. There's a fireplace over there, it's not on at the moment. Some pictures on the wall. Uh, let's go through here. Uh, nothing really in here. This might be a second kitchen which just sort of goes through to uh, the dining room again. Uh, this is the just sort of hallway that goes to the backyard which you've just seen out there. Uh I believe the kit yeah this is the kitchen. Newly fitted. So we've got various things around here. We've even got some taps and sinks here. Uh through here is the sitting room. You can see we've got large coffee table, large TV and speakers and uh it's the fireplace with some more couches and whatnot. Don't know why these are here, they're just sort of ornaments of sorts. Uh, here we have the cupboard. All our cupboards are named uh, GLaDOS uh, on the server. D don't actually ask why. Uh, I'm not actually at liberty to discuss that, but uh, let's just say it's a private joke. Uh, so, I think that's the main downstairs area. I don't believe. I find anything in this room? No, I haven't anything in this room yet. By the way, uh, these are actually curtains, in case uh, you're wondering. This nice little curtain pole up there, they're actually open in this room. Well, pretty much all of the rooms. Uh, more pictures, things of that nature. Uh, let's have a look through here. There's the bathroom. It was supposed to be a toilet, but I mean, it, just, it didn't really work out very well. Uh, sink, bath. I believe there's another one on the other side of this room. Yep. 
pretty much the same as the other one, just sort of mirrored. Uh, this side of the house, actually, let's see what's in here first. I think this is just a, another bedroom, yes. This is just a, a bedroom, and the door's broken, and it looks like the wardrobe door's broken. I don't know why doors do that sometimes, it's quite a mystery. Through here is the server room, with the Dell Server 1000. Uh, see the lights on the top there, and various towers in there. <coughs> Some more uh, chests. Uh, I think this is a guest room over here. Let's have a look. Oh, actually, no. This is the this is the office, the the, the home office essentially. Uh, we have we're basically surrounded by screens. There's the chair. Um, someone appears to have broken the chair. Uh, the curtains are closed for whatever reason. Uh, probably because I don't like the light. Uh, there's another computer setup over here. Got a nice sort of workbench type area there. And there's another TV. So let's go down this hallway. Nice large picture of what is seemingly a llama and a girl. Uh, in here we have another bedroom. Uh, you can see the curtains are semi covering the windows to at least block out some light. Uh, whoop, there we go. And another bedroom, pretty much just like looks like the other one. Uh, and I can't get out this door. Why are my doors broken? Got a feeling it actually might be me. And I think that's it for this side. So uh, on the other side, we have another bedroom. Uh, I don't know what was supposed to be here. Obviously, something I've removed. Uh, let's see what's down here. Uh, another bedroom. And another one. I don't actually know how many bedrooms I've got up to now. Maybe you could count them. Uh, the doors are broken again. Why? Honestly, this is this this must be some sort of server error. Look look at all these doors. Uh, this is my room, I believe. Uh, it's it doesn't have any light in it because I like to sleep in the dark. Uh, so I think that's about it for this floor. Let's go take a look in the attic. Oh, I didn't show you my basement either. I'll show you it very soon. So uh, this is the attic area. You can see the nice little window there. Uh, random hallway doesn't really serve any purpose. Uh, some rooms. I haven't really got round to furnishing any of these rooms yet. Let's see, we've got whoop, another room there. Uh, yeah, I think they pretty much all look like this. Uh, yeah, you can see houses outside and. Maybe a little bit of the city, not too sure. Uh, so, I think that's about it for this floor as well. Wow, this one's dark. Okay, so let's go to the basement. If I can move. Basically, I should probably disable fly mode, but uh, it's a bit faster. Sorry, didn't. Uh, so, let's go down. There we go. This is the basement. Hallway. A few pictures there. Some more down here. Uh, these, I believe, are empty rooms. I have a lot of empty rooms. I need to. I just with so much space, you, you don't really know what to do with it all. Uh, so uh, yeah, quite empty. Now let's let's have a look on the other side. Actually, no. I think the other side is pretty much the same as well. Yeah, it's pretty much the same. Uh, I believe there's some inventions down here. Oh, here's the doorbell control room. You see, it's uh, full of note blocks with various repeaters and whatnot to create a little jingle. Uh, through here, nothing. I think the inventions are this way. Ah, yes. Okay. So this interesting little invention was uh, essentially a trick. So, say if you was to put a door following here, I don't know why there's a vine there. So you just put a door here. Uh, essentially, you can walk through, and uh, there's two, dis well, sorry, four dispensers, and they'll fire arrows at you. So if you're in survival mode, it's probably not advised to walk through that archway. Use a few, lose a few of your, whoa, no, I've broken the door now. Uh, lose a few of your hearts. I've done it again. Uh, nothing in there. I think there might be some in here. Aha! So uh, this this was an interesting little invention. This was uh, some circuitry experimentation. So essentially, this is the starter mechanism. So you start it up like so. 
and uh, then you can do this. As you can see, we just started a repeating circuit. And then this one just kills the circuit. Like so. Sort of like emergency stop. Except it does actually break it. So you kind of have to put it back if you want it to be functional again. But, um, yeah. That was, was an, an interesting idea. To do this. So, uh, yeah. Let's just turn that off. And uh, out here, I believe there's another one through here. Ah, oh, now this is the... Uh, this is the door experimentation area. There's one very uncompleted on the wall there. Another one here, which is a work in progress. Essentially what I'm trying to do is uh, uh, close two doors that are three blocks high and then actually bring up a set of stairs and then push them out. Uh, it hasn't really gone too well so far. And the circuitry is growing in complication. So that might not be completed. Who really knows? Uh, that's the switch room again. I don't really think I have anything else down here. Uh, I think there might be a portal room through here. Actually, yes, there is. There's a ender portal, as you can see. Uh, so, I think that's about it. So, uh, if you enjoyed my Minecraft house tour, uh, feel free to like this video and possibly share it as well. Uh, just uh, let us know that uh, you, you care about someone's Minecraft house. <laughs> I have no life. And uh, perhaps next time we will go on a tour of someone else's house around here. So uh, I'll be talking to some of the server members and see if uh, they would like to give us a little tour of their houses. And uh, we'll see how it goes from there. So, I'm Jason Max, and you can find me on my website at jasonmax.com. You can email me, josh at jasonmax.com. Find me on Twitter at jasonmax. Also find my other YouTube videos at youtube.com forward slash jhdmax and do be sure to subscribe for latest tips, tricks and news from me. And you can also find my Minecraft server at mc.jhdmax.com. However, we aren't actually accepting any new members at this current time, so if you do go onto the server, likely you will be kept a guest. So this means you can't build or destroy anything on our server, as we have had a few problems in the past. However, this, I'm sure, will be sorted soon, and uh, some sort of... Uh, group policy will be applied to guests. So, until next time, over and out.